Hello again from Griffith First United Methodist Church. My name is Anne and welcome to our children's message this week. As you can see, we have our Advent candles up. We have two. This is going to be this coming Sunday is going to be the second week in Advent. And uh, today is the first. So we have, are you ready for Christmas? We got Christmas down here on the 25th. We have the first up here and we have 24 days until Christmas comes. This week's message is from Luke 3 verses 1 through 6 and it's prepare the way. You know with the 24 days until Christmas people often ask are you ready? Do you think that that question comes around quite a bit and you wonder what they mean by that? Are you ready? Ready for Christmas? What is it that you need to be ready for Christmas? Maybe is what we need to ask each other rather than, oh, are you ready for Christmas? Have you bought all your presents? Have you got your decorations up? But what do we really need to concentrate on to be ready for Christmas? So I wonder, are we ready for Christ at Christmas? In our Bible lesson today, we hear the voice of John the Baptist crying out to the people, prepare the way for the Lord, make straight paths for him. Every valley shall be filled in, every mountain and hill made low. The crooked roads shall become straight, the rough ways smooth, and all mankind will see God's salvation. Do you really think that John the Baptist really wanted the people to work on our roads? No, I don't think so. I think what John wanted was for the people to get ready for the coming of the Messiah, Jesus Christ. He was telling people to get their hearts right and return to God. No matter how good people may think they are, there are always some crooked ways and rough places in their lives. There are things such as dishonesty, selfishness, pride, jealousy, and many, many more. John wanted the people to make those crooked ways straight in preparation for Jesus' coming. During the Christmas season, we too can prepare by looking at our hearts and smoothing out the rough places like dishonesty and selfishness. And the good news is, God will help us. Let us ask him to do that right now. Dear Father, we want you to be ready for you. Make way our crooked paths. Make them straight in our rough places smooth. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks for joining me today. If you want to dig a little deeper into the scripture passage, you can go up on the sermonsforkids.com website with your parents' permission and download some of their activity pages. Try and get into the Bible. Try and read what they want you to do to prepare for Christmas. You know, Jesus came as a baby. And then we keep moving on towards Easter when he dies on the cross just for us. And in those in-between times, what does it say to you to get ready for Christ and for the kingdom? This will be our children's message is posted up on uh, every Wednesday up on our Griffith First United Methodist Facebook page. And we would love for you to join us in person or on Facebook at our Sunday worship services. Uh, they're at 1115 a.m. Central Time. And again, remember that we love you. God loves you. He wants to get closer to you. So reach out to him and prepare for Christmas. Thank you.